Okay, this is part two. This is uh, operating the new exam Drager uh, pump. They call it the Mark II. And I've kind of went over in part one that you do have to have an exam 2500 and it has to be at least at version 7.0. And you do have to have the belt clip attached on the back of it for it to operate. So I'm going to show you how to install it. It's real easy. Uh, with this belt clip, just make sure this uh, little loop is pushed back like that. Then you just go ahead and you install it this way. You just push it in. And you hear once you got it pushed in, the pump starts kicking on. Then you've got this clip here, which is just a, takes a little bit of push like that. Pop it back. Now it's snapped in place. That's the reason why you need this belt clip on there. That's uh, this little bailing wire kind of holds it in place like that. So this spring clip holds it in place. And you just turn it over and you can see it's asking you to do this uh, block test. So you go ahead and do your block test. And then you'll see it says to unblock it. And you go ahead and you unblock it. And now it's all ready to go. And that's basically it. Um, if you want to shut it off, you can shut it off by turning your air monitor off, and it'll also shut off the pump. Or you can pop it out, and you give it a few seconds, and then the pump will shut off also. But I'll just show you an example. I'll go ahead and turn this over, pop this out. Okay, I got it totally out. You can hear the pump is still going. And if you just give it a minute or so, the pump will shut off. Okay, now it's shut off. So you can do it that way. Or uh, I'll pop this back in. You can see it one more time. Okay, you make sure the loop is pushed up. And get the strap out of the way. You go ahead and you push it in. You go ahead and push this clip back. Flip it over. And um, sometimes you get this little exclamation in the beginning. It'll go away after a while, or you can just push the green button. And now it's telling me my battery power. Push it again. You can see it tells you to do the block test. I do the block test. Okay, it says stop. I stop. And then everything goes back to working. And like I was showing you, you can go ahead and you can turn it off here. If you just go ahead and turn your Drager off your uh, air monitor off and you can hear the pump turned off also so you can do it either way and basically that's it that's how you operate it it's pretty much the same as the other one with the block test and everything